and this week's theme on 7 Gymnastics Girls is back limber tutorial. So I'm going to show you guys how to do a back limber and before we start I need to say what you should stretch. You should always stretch your wrists, back, shoulders and that's about it. But if you feel like you need to stretch other parts of your body go ahead and do that. So let's get started. This is the back limber all put together. Some skills you'll need are a back walkover. You should have a back bend and a kickover. And lastly, a handstand pike down is going to help with the end of the back limber. So let's move on to the tutorial. You're going to start with your arms up by your ears and your legs should be shoulder width apart unless you have a perfect back bend. Then you can start with your legs together. You're going to start with going back into your back bend, then pressing on your shoulders. You can practice some drills by kicking your feet up. This is the main part of the back limber. From the bridge, you should be pressing up into a handstand and then piking down, ending with your arms up. You should not be kicking your legs up into a handstand to get to the handstand. This is the final skill, and once again, I'm not the best at back limbers, so, and I know I don't connect it, but a lot of people do, I just am not the best at it. I hope you guys got your back limber, or got your back limber better after watching this video. Shoutouts from last week go to... For a chance to get a shoutout in next week's video, comment below if you already had your back limber, if you're working on it, or if you just don't have it at all. You guys can see me every Friday on 7 Gymnastics Girls. Bye! See you next week!